trying to figure out. Hi again. Trying to figure out what to start on this time. Y'all can't see all the adjustments I'm having to make right now, but whatever. I talked about quite a bit in the last video, and I'm going to have to try to figure out whether I'm going to have to edit this down, or do it again, or see whether or not I even can edit it on the system I'm using right now. It's up in the air. I don't But, I was on wet and wild stuff, and then that's when I realized that I went over with the minutes and so on and so forth. So, mm -hmm. Okay. Got these little cover girl things. They were a mess for some, but they were clearing them out, so I thought I would pick up as many as I can. And I think I'm missing, I want to say, sorry, I want to say I'm missing about three of them. Shine glass. A lot of people are not crazy about these because of the way that they feel. Like I said, they're going to make for some. Me, they don't really bother all that much, like whatever. They'd be great for like if you have a sticky flip off, you take a little bit of a ribbon and then you add sticky. I picked up in no particular order, 830 Dazzle, 870 Glimmer, 800, which is Glow, Clear, 845, which is Flare, so that's Flare, Glow, Glimmer, and then Dazzle. I don't remember what this one is, I just want to say 10. <coughs> I don't know if it's like a blaze or something like that. Something that starts with an egg. Tag it in the morning or something if I ever find it again. 865 is night. This one is, what is it, like a fire? I don't know what it is. But anyway, 850, which is a blaze. And 805, which is radiation. Last one is Fire 880. So that's that. They were getting rid of these. I don't know. I feel like I've done this before. And maybe I have. Uh, this is the lipstick and cheeky. I got that. Got that color there. Kind of a corally color. And then there's a lighter version. There's a little more pink in it on the other side. Which, like Liz said, I mean, the only safe embrace with these, I mean, yeah, like she said, you can take colors, look through colors, and mix and match and do whatever. But at the same time, these guys right here make it easy for travel. So we got something. Uh, yeah, this was three seventy five at Family Dollar. And I think it was, I want to say it was six. Six, maybe on seven. Something like that. I don't know. So. And then the amazement that we're getting rid of the to the Walgreens. As well. Quite a few of them. 
I think I'll just list all the names in the in the down bar, down bar description box, whatever. So you want to know what they are and all this other kind of stuff. You know, a little bit more detail. Let me know. But since there's just three of these, as far as the clean collection is concerned, I'll tell you what these are. These, this is Q220 Ebony Bronze 1. This guy is Q215 Brown Bronze 2. And I believe this one is my color right here. 205 Light Bronze 2. Definitely one I was using. The other ones are kind of like contour, maybe a, a neutral, cheap color. These three are the light ones that I got from Family Dollar. For some strange reason, they don't seem to carry, except for the Queen collection, they don't seem to carry any of the darker tones. They don't carry, like, honey, tawny, and the almond color. They don't carry those. And then I noticed, too, at Walg in Walgreens, every time they get ready to get rid of a color, it's always the darkest colors. Those always seem to go first. What is that about? Anyway, this is 120 Creamy Natural. Covering the wrong thing. Covering the product, the other thing. Okay, that's that one. That's Creamy Natural. In the new packaging. So there's no telling what they're doing with that either. And then there's this one. This is 125 Buff Beige. And then this guy here in 140 Natural Beige. And you say, Yes, but what do you do with those? I'm a makeup artist. I used to wear them. Yeah. Some things tone things down, some things brighten other things up. Lots of interesting things. As I said before, I have two of these, which is the I Love Matte from Sweat and Wild. But I got the these eight pan palettes that everybody talks about. The favorite being Comfort Zone, which looks a lot like looks a lot like the Downtown Browns. That that lets you know right there that that's from the same company. They made them they got the same packaging and so on and so forth. The only thing that may be a tad different is what they've got written on the back. Other than that. Down at the bottom, distributed by Mark Wynn. Mark Wynn's beauty products, beauty products and stuff. Black Radiant, White Wild. Yeah. yeah. But, you know, the more you get of them, hey, whatever floats your boat. I've got the regular in these, but I also have the spring collection. I think it was like spring 2010 that everybody was going after. I may get a second set of these. I may not. I don't know. So, yeah. I know I didn't call out the names, but everybody knows what they look like. So, it's really not important to really do all of that. Now, there were some things that they were letting go as far as the 75% off at right age for physicians formula, so that's what they meant that's it, including what I love collecting is Kabuki brushes. So that's the nice bamboo one. And then this guy here is the bamboo wear. It's a compact. I'm having a difficult time opening it because I'm not used to this. There's the brush for it. There's the mirror without blinding you. And there's the top and everything kind of swings one way or the other. And your powder goes in here. And these are your little magnets right here. So, yeah. So, 
I don't remember the prices. If I find that information, I'll let you know. This one is a baked pyramid, which is a wet, dry, matte bronzer in baked pan. So, a lot of people prefer matte bronzers as opposed to the shiny one. And then these guys here. On the side, mineral wear, talc free, mineral correcting pebbles. I have translucent and creamy natural. But that's what the guys look like on the bottom. And on the top, when you open it up, of course, you get, you get your mirror. And then you get this puff right here. And that's what they look like inside there. Also get this little brush with it, a little tricolor brush. So that's what the brushes look like. And I show you the compact, so there's that. Dollar General. Again, I am heavily into zebra stuff right now, so I got this little thing here that says zebra love notes, and then I have this little clipboard here that has a little zebra pattern on it, and I went again zebra crazy and got the last two zebra print lamp shades that they have, sorry, he didn't get it. okay, and a latte mug. It says, that would be, I'm a diva. I'm a diva in the house. You know, you know that. That is it. Okay. So. Um. Rounding up the last of things for a few minutes, I guess, until I get to the profusion and stuff that I did see. Special. 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 Special shot. Did I did. Coastal scent. Smoky palette. 36 eye shadow color stain. They sent this along with it. It's a miniature brush set. I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with this. It's so small. What you want to do with perfect. Hey. Anyway. But. Yeah. Several people on the tune have talked about this. Now, it's difficult to tell to open when you get it. Yeah, I said it. It's difficult to open when you get it. And I somehow popped the little piece off of here. I could have told folks something about it, but I didn't really feel like going for all the little changes. So, yeah, this is mine. It is what it is. And at various times, well, one of my goals is to own all of the hot pots. Yeah, and I say to myself, good luck with that. I do, however, dig the little price, but these are some of the ones that I managed to purchase. I'm covering up the mirror with my, my label because I have the special listings for myself like. Well, it's a number, because I want to know what the number is, but I have to keep pulling out each one and what they name it on the site and some of the names that they have. Are they talking about me? Stop. And this is nice. Thank you. Anyway, the names on the site are kind of hilarious, but it's okay. They made, a, they, made a, they made a valid effort. Can't knock them for that. And then this was the first set that I have. The names are on the other side of this piece of paper. But you know, this is the first set that I have. There are deeper colors over here. And if anybody wants me to, I'll go over the, the colors, you know, the dupe colors that they're supposed to be. It's a dupe list that actually Corin Encore Makeup gave out. Oh gosh, when they first came out. So this was like a few years ago. We're talking about what, maybe 08? 708 now? Man, time is flying like four or five years into this thing. 
I didn't start making videos myself until 07, I believe. Yeah. So basically, off and on, I've been at this. Well, we have to take the, what, one and a half, two years that I haven't been on. I'll probably say roughly. I've been doing this for about three years now. Two and a half, three years. This was my first one where I collected as many rights as I could. So, that's that. But of course, I have to create number one. I had to get it. That mirror up. But yeah, I had to get that. I don't have any of the other smaller palettes because I figured I was going to make my own once I got everything else together. And this is creative number two. Everybody knows what that looks like. Okay. So, yeah. I will see you guys later. Hope for fusion.